What's up? I'm going to be reviewing the Court Borf Mid 2 Nike. All right, let's get into it. All right. Here it is. Here's the box. Let's just see what we got. All right. It looks like they came pre-tied and velcroed and everything. So, just can't already one. So, probably I don't know. But as you can see, size four and a half. In the UK, it's four. Europe, thirty-six and a half. These are in all black, as you can see on the bottom. On the inside, it's just pure black. And then you got the stitching right there on the bottom. And then you have this, it's a Velcro buckle. And just open it like that. And then you can put it on like that. I got these for, well, I actually got these at Rack Room Shoes. I don't know why, but I did. So, I got these at Rack Room Shoes for $65, but with everything I got, I ended up saving, like, I don't know how much. I saved like $22 and 60 something cent or something. I don't know. But I got them for $65 at Rack of Shoes, but my total was like 69 something. I don't really care. Because now I'm just happy I have them. You know, do you, you know there's like the red one of these? You know those things? Yeah, for some, I was thinking about getting the red ones. But the reason I didn't get the red ones was because, well, they had a little bit of white and I didn't like it because I wanted just something. And also, they didn't really have my size. Well, I think they did, but they didn't. I don't think they had my size in the red one. Which I'm pretty happy about because I'm happy with these ones. Because. And then I did like an Easter egg hunt and got pollen all over this. And my the Easter egg hunt was at like my grandpa's house, I think. Yeah, it was at my grandpa's house. So what I did was, and my grandpa gave me like a shoe shiner kit that my great grandpa made. So yeah, well he made the pack box for it. There's just a bunch of like 10, 20 year old shoe shiner stuff in there. Didn't really need that, so we're probably just gonna open it and see what it it's like and then probably throw it away it also came with some brushes but yeah so that's basically what i've been using but also i've been using wipes uh, also to keep these but i just like wet the brushes and then just brush the pollen off then take a wipe and wipe them down and then you'll have and then they'll just look fresh again so, yeah, I'm probably just going to throw this one. 